In this training video, I'm going to show you how to apply one of the new film frame effects to a photo. Under the Select Effect menu, I'm going to go under the Frames category and choose Film Frames. Once the Film Frames effect has been loaded up, I'm going to choose the Select Frame button. This brings up the catalog of effects on screen. You'll notice that there's two categories of film frames. There are single frames, which allow you to place one photo inside one frame, and there are multiple frames. Multiple frames allow you to place different photos inside each frame within the same composition. For this tutorial, we're going to show you how to apply a single frame. We can scroll along and see that there's a whole wealth of content to choose from from conservative film frames to some pretty artistic versions. In this case I'm going to load up SF003. Now that the film frame has been loaded and applied around the photo you can see how gorgeous these really are. In this case the film frame has been applied around the photo. The photo has been scaled a bit inside the frame but I'd like to make some adjustments to the way that the photo is cropped inside the frame. So I'm going to go over here and I'm going to select the Transform Photo Tool. When I do this, you're going to notice around the photo we've got some transform handles. By grabbing the corners, I can control the scale and I can even rotate the photo inside the frame itself to fit the needs for this composition. Okay, I like how that looks, so I'm going to click on the Transform Photo tool again, and that turns off my handles. I'd like to go ahead though and transform the frame, so I'm going to click on the Transform tool here, and I'm just going to drag my frame smaller within my composition and position it right here in the center. I can rotate the frame as desired, and I can also go rotate the photo inside the frame, just like that. Now one of the nice features about film frames is you can choose different backgrounds to apply behind the film frame itself. So I've chosen background texture, I'm going to choose a modeled texture, and I'm going to appear something, I'll choose something here that's going to work pretty well for this particular frame. And there we go. So film frame is pretty easy effect to work with. It yields some powerful results and we think you're really going to love it.